Well, good morning, St. Tom's. Um, yeah, a bit of a, a shock, a few events. Um, picked up a bad blood test, uh, which they repeated, um, showing that uh, muscle tissue in the heart had uh, broken down and was present in the blood. Uh, apparently, uh, experts say that um, that, uh, that enzyme can only have come from there. So with the protocols in place in laboratory testing, which I'm well aware of, uh, that's the sort of work that I'm involved with, um, there's no doubt that those laboratory tests were right. Um, I was air-vacked out uh, to a, a cardiac unit uh, specialist hospital in Palm Springs, and um, they ran further tests, well, loads of tests and uh, stress tests, all sorts of things, and another blood test, and uh, praise God that uh, the level has dropped uh, to a level where I can... Uh, get back on the bike. So um, right now I'm just trying to rest up with my family. They're here. We've been blessed with a house, a car, 500 bucks worth of spending money, um, shopping, oh, everything. Uh, awesome. So I just want to give all the glory to God. He healed me. I've, been, I've brushed against death's door. But in Romans 10, 9, if you confess with your mouth Jesus is Lord and believe in your heart that God raised him from the dead, you will be saved. And that is my faith in a nutshell. Uh, I had such peace, uh, understanding I was going to die um, pretty much uh, within the hour. Um, I said cheerio to the boys and the team, uh, but was very, very uh, content with it all because I know where I'm going because of God's rich promises to me and to you. If you believe and if you don't believe, you need to read Romans 10, 9 and understand it. Uh, God bless you all. Thank you for your support. I'll be back on the bike ride uh, as soon as I'm well enough, just having a few days rest. Bye.